Hello, everyone. My name is Peng Tian. I'm the director of the University of Missouri Plant Diagnostic Clinic. Today, let's talk about spotted lanternfly, the unwelcomed in Missouri. The scientific name of the spotted lanternfly is called a Lycorma delicatula. It is an invasive sap-sucking insect, which has a very broad host range. This insect can infect several species of trees and ornamentals, including maple tree, black walnut, rose, grape, apple, and even herbaceous plants like eucalyptus. The primary host, which is a favorite plant of spider lamp fly, is the tree of heaven, which is also an invasive species, according to Missouri Department of Conservation. Therefore, if you see this plant in your property, it is better to get rid of them. If you are not sure about it, you can contact MU Plant Diagnostic Clinic for plant ID services. There are four stages of spotted lanternfly life cycle, beginning with the egg mass in the winter. In the spring, it will be uh, hatched and uh, leads to the uh, two stages of NAF uh, in spring and summer. And those wingless insects will further develop into the adult with two big wings with the uh, black spot all over the wings. And fall, which is now where we are, uh, is the best time for us to see them around. And this is also the time they start to feed on the plants, mating and laying eggs. Once we enter into the winter, they normally will die off due to the harsh weather and the uh, egg mass will for formed in the winter and a new round of the life cycle begins. For some unknown reasons, the spotted lanternflies loves to gather together, feeding on the trunk, the branches, the stem or twigs of the plants. And this can lead to the formation of black sooty mold, which is shown here on this photo. And that will reduce the photosynthesis of the plant as well as the plant's hardiness. Since I, like I mentioned, that spotted lanternfly has a really broad host range and therefore it uh, can negatively infect the agriculture, horticulture, ecology, as well as economy. The spotted lanternflies were first discovered in Pennsylvania in 2014. Since then, the population as well as the coverage of this insect has been drastically increasing due to the lack of the native predators. As you can see in this map, they're not only showing in the East Coast, but also in the Middle West, such as Indiana, Kentucky. You may wonder about Missouri. Unfortunately, according to the potential distribution of spotted lanternfly in the United States, Missouri was in the red zone, in indicating that Missouri has a really high risk to be invaded by spotted lanternfly. The fact is, we did receive a recent report that fortunately a dead spotted lanternfly had been found under the truck in St. Louis. That truck was from Pennsylvania. So it will be uh, just a matter of time for us to see this insect in Missouri. So with all of that, what can we do? First, the Missouri Department of Agriculture has a really nice fact sheet brochure over someone here that can help you to differentiate the spotted lanternflies from other insects. Uh, this is going to be very helpful for you to characterize that once you see some insects that look like this. Second, if you see some insect that looks like or resemble the spotted lanternfly morphologically, please take a photo and collect the insect and report your find to MDA or MU Plant Diagnostic Clinic.